Alright, welcome to Capybara Spa, quite possibly the cutest game on Steam. This is going to be a brief let's play, it's a pretty short game, but I think it's really cute. And let's go ahead and get started without further ado. So, we're gonna start a new game, and the instructions say, well, are they instructions? I think so. Welcome to Capybara Spa. Unfortunately, there are no spas and no capybaras. All of the animals ran off after a bad storm left the mountain in ruins. Clean up, furnish, and decorate the mountain to bring back the capybaras and all of their furry, scaly, and feathery friends. Sounds adorable. Good luck finding all of the animals and have fun. I sure will. Hell yeah. Alright. So, let's see. Click on the arrow keys or hold down right click to move the camera. Alright, now I made the scroll a little bit slower than usual and it's still pretty fast. So, let me go ahead and change that. Oh. It just all reset the settings, I guess? So, maybe it's save file based? Anyway, so I'll make the uh, scrolling a little bit um, a little bit slower so that it doesn't give anyone motion sickness. So, we're supposed to now purchase an orange tub and place it down in our spa. Alright. So we have this orange tub. I'm gonna put it... let's put it right here. It's pretty adorable, not gonna lie. Pick up a capybara and place it in the orange tub. So it's worth noting that this game was actually made by a one-person team. Uh, a solo, it's a solo dev, a solo indie game dev project. And there we go. Look at that capybara just bathing. So cute. Um, but they make really adorable little games. Um, I'd like to let's play some of their other games as well. So let's see, purchase a carrot garden and give the capybara a snack. Don't mind if I do. So let's put the carrot garden down. You can see he wants a carrot, because he's got a little carrot beach bubble above his head. That's adorable. And, oh, here, let's give him the carrot. Oh my god, it's so cute. Now, while you're waiting for the carrots to grow, you can also click on these little weeds, you know, flowers, and... Uh, and let's put this capybara down so we can grab this one. Um, and there's stones and mushrooms you can click on, and you can see it gives you a little bit of XP and um, coins when you do that, so you can save up money that way. However, uh, the game is now telling us to pick up the capybara and place it back on its ground after its stay. Oh my god, this is so cute. So we can put it on the ground like that. Click on a new space to clean it up to expand your spot. Alright, let's do that. Um, so let's go ahead and clean up this spot with all the mushrooms. So we can clean the space, it costs 20 coins. Go ahead and do that. Alright, we got a new clear space now. And look at all these dirty little happy bars. So, I'll stick one into bath. Oh my god, this is so cute. Um, one thing that I'm really always impressed by with this dev's work is how cute and cozy their games are. Um, and like, it's not like they're... Like, their games are... they're not quite low-poly aesthetic and they're not quite... You know, they're not high fidelity 3D graphics either, but I feel like they make really, really, really good use of colors and visual effects, and it really adds a lot to their game. They're just, they're really good at visual design. Alright, so we gave him another carrot. Um, we can go ahead and actually build another carrot garden. They only cost eight coins, so I'm gonna, um, I'm actually gonna build another carrot garden too, just so that we don't have to wait for carrots. I suppose we should build another tub, too, huh? Go ahead and build- oh, we don't have enough coins, okay. <laughs> well, we can go ahead and take this little guy, and he's gonna give us 5 coins and 10 XP. And actually, here's something really cute. If you pick up the capybara and you drop them in the air- Oh my god, they have little parachutes. It's so cute. It is like- this game is like sickeningly cute, but it's the kind of sick that I am glad to be. <laughs> you know what I mean? Oh my gosh, okay. Um, so here we've got another dirty cappy. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Carrot, there you go, there's your snack. And we've almost reached level 2 as well. For this let's play, I think I'm gonna go um, until we reach the end of the content that's available in the game. Well, I mean, yeah, I would hope I would finish it. <laughs> but like a lot of the games I play are kind of like endless type games. And this game is too. You don't have to, um, the game doesn't, you know, completely lock you out of playing it after you reach the end of, um, you know, after you reach the maximum level or whatever. Alright, so we got 
a level up off of that. Happy care, ha blah, 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 happy capybara. And now the game's telling us about how we can click on little bits on the ground to get XP and coins. You can see that filling up our XP bar as well. Um, but anyway, so like, um, we also unlocked jasmine flowers. Uh, so hold on a second. So we got this happy capy right here. I'm gonna put these two in baths. And I think, I don't think either of them will ask for a jasmine flower until we've, like, acquired the jasmine flower plot. But I think that the jasmine flowers, like, make them give you more coins and XP when they are happy and finished with their bath. See, we don't have quite enough coins to buy, to clear this space. Okay. How do I close that? How do I- Oh, I just, uh, like, unselect it. Or select it, click it again to deselect it. Oh my god, they're so cute. Alright, this one's happy. There we go. Five coins. And now we have enough, um... So these are decorations, I think, in this tab. Um, so we got this jasmine flower that we can... Hmm. But I kind of want to put... Oops. <laughs> I kind of want to put, um... Let's see. Wait. Oh yeah, it gave us our money back. Good. Or did it? I don't think it did. Hold on. I really- I want to get rid of this jasmine flower that's on my cursor. Okay, it won't let me. Um, I think we can move them later. So we'll just put the jasmine flower plot here. See, I'm, I want- I want this- I want this capybara spa to look exactly correct for how I want it to look. <laughs> so I'm being a bit obsessive. I know there is a way to get the- the jasmine flower, um, bed off of your cursor, but I don't remember. I don't remember it. I'll, I'm sure I'll figure it out. Anyway, look at this capybara has a just a, oh I can zoom in. Oh my god, I'm so happy. So we can see the capybara has just a little jasmine flower in their hair. Oh my god, it's so cute. Oh, and this guy wants a carrot. All right, there you go. You can also see that the capybaras are different colors. They have different fur colors, which I think is adorable. Oop. Little parachute. Oh my gosh. All right, let's see. Are you happy yet? Are you done? He's got a heart on him, but he's not- Ah! Dirty cappy! There you go. And jasmine flower for you, and actually we have quite a lot of money now. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and clean this space. And can we move this? Can we just like move it? Aha! There we go! Move the jasmine flower! Boop! I can't stop doing the parachute, it's so cute. It's just very, 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 very sweet. Oh my gosh. Alright, what do you want? Jasmine flower. And let's see, we're almost to level 3 as well, which is really nice. Maybe we should get an additional jasmine flower. Oh, but we can't afford it yet. Uh, we should also probably get additional baths. Actually, yeah, we have just enough for a third tub, so let's get a third orange tub going. Um, we're gonna struggle a little bit without an additional jasmine flower bed, but... Okay, so, so at level 3 we unlock a square banner, which is a decoration that we can place to liven up our spa. Okay, square banner. Oh, we don't have enough coins yet. Okay, hold on. We can fix that. Let's see, how much is the square banner now? Eight? It costs eight coins? Okay, neato. And we got these dirty, dirty copies. Um, let's go click on like some mushrooms and stones and stuff. Little mushrooms, little rocks, little flowers, weeds, and whatnot. Oh, hi buddy. Sorry about that. Carrots for the capybaras. Oh, and right, and since we have a third bath, we can put this guy in the bath too. Um, and then once we get a little bit more income, I'm gonna put another jasmine flower right there. Jasmine flower. Oh. Game has been saved. Yeah, see, we need, we need a bunch more jasmine flowers because everybody wants jasmine flowers now. And we have to wait for them uh, to grow. I think you can upgrade tiles. Like, yeah, see, we could upgrade the jasmine flower tile for 32 coins, which... Wait, really? Because that's exactly how much we have. I don't think I'm going to upgrade it, though. I think I'm going to wait. Um, and on clean this... Oh, it costs 40 coins to, cl to clear that space off. Okay. That's more than before. Here, we'll take these sturdy capybars and put them in a bath. Alright, so we'll go ahead and clean that. Boop. <laughs> oh my god, so cute. Carrot! Carrot! 
Okay. Kind of weed. We don't want weeds in our spa. No, we don't. No weeds in this spa. Let's see how much we have enough for another jasmine flower patch or patch? Patch? Bed? Flower bed? Well, whatever. We have enough for more jasmine, so that's good. <laughs> oh my god, it's so cute. And we can zoom all the way out, too. Right, there we go. Get clean! Wait, I keep forgetting about our third bath. Let's see, are there any other dirty capybaras around here? There's one. Get it- oop! Oop! <laughs> Get in the bath, little dude. Alright, now click on these things. Okay, and let's see. Any of you want carrots? You do. I kind of wonder if we should make more baths, like another bath with the the money that we're saving up. You know, like here. But it's costing more and more each time we want to expand, so maybe we'll leave it for now. On the other hand, aesthetic symmetry. You know, we got baths over here, but not over here. Just saying. Oh my god, everything is so cute in this game. Like, every little bit, of, every little piece of it is beautiful and cute. Alright. We're getting close to level 4. That's nice, 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 nice. Oh my god, so cute. Carrot for you. How much? We have 50 coins now, so we could expand again. Which I might do. Oh. But first we need a little bit more money because we can't actually place a bath without money either. So if we want a bath and a space cleared. We're gonna need money. Ooh. We reached level four and unlocked the strawberry plant. And the game's telling us we can upgrade our gardens to grow fruit and flowers faster as well. Hmm. We'll definitely want to do that, but I think for now we're good because we don't have that many baths. Yeah, okay, but it's telling us- it's telling us to grow a strawberry plant, so... Um... Why don't we go ahead and clear the space and build a strawberry plant once we get enough money for that? Let's get rid of that menu. Dirty capybara. How much was it for a strawberry plant? 24? Okay, there we go. Now we have a strawberry plant. There you go, buddy. Oh my god, the capybars are so cute. Jasmine flower. I don't know if we even, like, do we even need more than one jasmine plant at this point? Well, we're gonna keep expanding, though, so... Maybe we'll need one later. Maybe we'll need a second jasmine plant later. Yeah, see, like... Oh, we already have another flower, never mind. <laughs> I guess we're okay. Alright. And we're finally getting a use out of that strawberry plant. Wait, so so we actually get coins from just like from giving them the food. Okay, so that's... I wasn't sure if the coins came like when we gave it to them or when they finished their bath. More carrots? What was I gonna... Oh yeah, I was gonna build another orange bath. Maybe we should wait on that. Hmm... And just like upgrade. Well, no. I guess we'll get another orange bath. Let's see. We don't have enough money to even clear the space yet, though, so we shouldn't worry about it too much. Let's see if we can find another dirty capybara. Hey, buddy, come on. Do they have like? No, I was I was wondering if they have like, like kind of, like moving physics for when you like drag them around, like dragging physics. For a second, I thought they did, but I don't think they do actually. <laughs> I think I was just imagining it. I think it was just their idle animation, basically. Anybody want a carrot? I like that you can take the the plants out, but then you can just stick them back in the ground. It's good not just from like a quality of life perspective, but also like a cuteness perspective, I guess. So here's our strawberry. There you go, buddy. Carrots. These are some happy capybaras. Happy campies. Okay. Oop. 
Um, and now we have enough money to clean that space off. Oh, and you get ex do you get experience for doing that? You do. That's nice. That's very nice. Let's see if we can get another dirty cappy. Oh, hi. Hi, buddy. Right over here. Give a carrot to this friend. And I want one more orange bath, just for the aesthetic symmetry, right? I am that neurotic. Jasmine flower. Boop. It gets hard to keep track of after a while when you get this many capybaras. You know? Alright. Let's see, we got... We're waiting for all the strawberry to grow, but we can put another capybara in this bath. I really want to decorate a bit more, but I don't know if I should do that yet or wait until we get more money. Carrot! Strawberry! Alright, one more carrot. Oh, several more actually, and we need another strawberry too. Hey, maybe we should upgrade our carrot, um, our carrot, our carrot patches. Um, jasmine flower. See, I'm too busy just, like, managing the spa. And happily busy, mind you. Uh, I'm too busy managing the spa to actually, like, think about what I should upgrade to be optimal. Anyway, the game says to place a baby capybara, upgrade the tub and add them alongside an adult capybara. That's adorable, first of all. Look at this little guy. And he also has a parachute, by the way. Very cute. Um, but before we move on to adding baby capybaras to capybara baths, I think I'm going to call it an episode. And um, I'm hoping to see you next time. I hope you enjoy this cute little Let's Play. See you next time! <laughs>